Oh, this is the first time I've ever done stuff ever, and it had to be in Georgia. I honestly didn't have to be in Georgia. They do not play. <laughs> oh my god. Damn. What do you have to say about that? I'm scared. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Yo, no cap, that, that cop kind of thick. <laughs> What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video. As you see, we drove from Orlando to Atlanta, Georgia for SneakerCon. We're in the back end where all the vendors are setting up. Everybody's driving up. We actually stayed at the hotel in the convention center just to make it easier to transport everything. As you guys saw, I was driving over here and I got a stop on the way. So um, this is the ticket that I got. The first time I've ever gotten pulled over and I got a ticket in, in Georgia. Long story short, I'm gonna mark up all my prices for 20%. Today we're gonna focus on selling, see if we can try to cash out on a few steals here and there too, but primarily selling. I brought like 60% of my inventory just to try to get off. But yeah, let's just get inside. We're still setting up, so we're gonna finish setting up and uh, let's see how today goes. Yeah. yeah. So as you see, we're inside here, everybody, um, setting up their booths, tables, trading puts down there, eBay authentications right there. Um, I've actually seen a few bangers in here. This is one table with Red Octobers, OG Chicago's, a little bit of everything, vintage. If you guys haven't gone to SneakerCon before, I really suggest you guys to do it because there's a little bit of everything. So we're pulling up here at the table. It's gonna be me, O-Town, Isaiah, Tommy, and a few others that I can't really remember right now, but we're all setting up. We still haven't finished unloading from the hotel. We stashed all of our shoes in the hotel. setting it up the table. I still gotta set up the clothing, but one of my boys pulled up, he sent me a list. He gave me a few shoes that he was looking for, so I'm just uh, boxing them all up for him and then gotta sell them. So I just finished selling about 10 pairs, all my hyper old men's, fog uh, size 12, Cobalt men's and a UNLV. Uh, all for my guy, Tech Plug. I think the total came out to be 20, 2,800. He just finished cashing me out. No face, no case for him, but um, yeah, he's about to cash me out right now. All right, so we're gonna go walk outside. The line is, I heard it's pretty long right now. So I'm gonna try to catch out some steals, see if we can get whatever we can get over there. And then we're gonna try to, once everybody has gone in here, we're gonna try to make our way towards the training pit and try to get some steals. Frank, how you doing? Yes, sir. I'm gonna try to cash out a few steals from the people walking in. What happened? Is there deals on it? I don't know. I've been here and it's tough. I literally just tried to do it right now. <laughs> All right, bro, thank you. Oh. I don't think they're allowing people to buy right now in the line. Hey boss, are you selling those? Yeah. How much are you selling them for? Uh, these are a little bit barely used. Okay. Minute, and then uh, I'm selling these for 450. Okay, so like, what's the best one that you used? 380. Uh, probably be like 280 or something like that. Uh, nah, I'm good. Uh, what's, the, what's the other lot? Uh, 15. How much are you asking for that? 450. Okay, I appreciate it. Huh? line is insane, oh, dude. Shit. You think Dallas was bad? Bro, this is, it wraps in there? Bro, it wraps. Dude. Oh shit, let's do this. I don't wanna like, I wasn't gonna, I'm not buying, but. This is way crazier was... than last Atlanta. That's wild. Yeah, we're gonna go through the back and just gonna try to, look, look, look at Panhandle already cheating. King of Kicks. 
That's what they call me. <laughs> You're already making a cheap, cheap move and setting all the steals, huh? So I don't really know what I'm buying, but um, anything heat, probably lots, dumps, some fillings of like lightning, shadows, anything that's, that I've sold lately. I just sold Hyper Oil, so probably stock up on those. I think that was the last of my Hyper Oils. Well, it's probably, it's like a snake. I don't know if you can get that, but it's, I think it wraps around like six or seven different times. And um, yeah, see if we can catch any steals out here. Don't know what to even buy, but. Hey, excuse me, boss. What phones are those? The new ones, the Oprah's? What size is it? 11. How much are you asking? Do you know how much he's asking? Or? Oh, no, I'm trying to trade with him. Oh, okay, you're gonna do a trade? Yeah. Okay. So you wouldn't do like 160 or 180? Okay. All right, thank you. What's up? I'm Marcus from Fresh Vaz. Fresh underscore Vaz on Instagram. F A D S. Oh no, not. He's a man on YouTube, bro. Right? He's a legend. He's cool as fuck. What's up? Yeah. Now you gotta give me. Now you gotta sell me something. Not sell something. <laughs> I'm trying to say, I would gladly sell you something for the right price. Okay, makes sense. Makes sense. What do you got? What do you got? Okay, so that would actually work so much better. Can you hold up? Organization is a key. Yes, sir. It is. Save yourself the time to just oh, do this, everybody. List? I made a list myself. You know I got the list, man. He just sold this. Okay, Jubilee, Fire Red. So what's the best you can do on the Fire Red, the Jubilee and the Shimmer? Uh, Shimmer's already sold, Jubilee's already sold. But I do have the Fires for you. Dang, I was trying to get uh, multiple. It seems like you already sold all your stuff. Um, I guess what's your best price on the Fire Red? That's probably the only. Before I give you a price, those don't have the hang tag. So the OG owner like the, the hang tag. Oh, okay. I mean, I guess knock off a little bit for. Yes, yeah, I got you, bro. Uh, yeah. So I'm like two dollars for the hang tag. Two dollars? <laughs> uh, you could do. I wanted. What did I say? Was it three thirty on there? Yeah, three thirty. Three fifteen. I was. I was honestly at two eighty. Because market is like three fifteen right now. Uh, as high as thirteen? Yeah. Three fifteen. Maybe like me at three. Uh, That's probably the best I can do on it. Three ten? Coin flip? Three ten? Three ten? Yeah, I see it. I just see it. Got on camera? Yeah. Camera quality is good. Let me see. Let me see. Oh no, now it's good. Uh, what do you want? So I get three ten, three hundred coin flip. I gotta go with tails because tails never fails. Shoot. All right, let's see heads. Maybe up two. Maybe up two. Heads or tails? Woo! That's tails. Yeah, tails never fails here. Three ten. Three ten, right? Yes, big bills, big bills. I hope so. <laughs> what do you say? That'd be a good look. Those yellow ones for. Sorry. I was asking him what he sold those yellow pair for. Uh, for what you wanted? For those like two dollars. I want some ten dollars. Right? I get those for retail though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I sold for two fifty. Three ten. Yeah, I sold for two fifty. Appreciate you, buddy. I don't hey, know. If you, did page. you did you already give yourself a shout out? Yeah, I believe so. But doing a show on the page. Five. My bad. I did not, I added an E in there. So right now, my man just pulled up with a size 12 mono ice. He's trying to trade a, a size 12 mono ice and a size 12 Oreo 4 for one of my lots, size 12. It's not a bad trade. It's gonna be a straight trade. I try to, try to add on top, or make him add on top, but it's gonna really uh, work out. Which one did you want? This one? Yeah. Think about that. All right. So size 12, lot 5, traded for Oreo Ford and Mono Ice. Feel free to give yourself a shout out on YouTube. Uh, Nick Slat, take me out. Go. I'll box these out for you. I just finished doing the trade for the two size 12s and the lot. I value a lot pretty high. Um, I, I just want all the lots, but trade like this, I think it's value that payout is at 550. I was selling them for 550, so you can't go wrong. I made an extra like 50, 80 bucks. I, I, probably, I sold the lot for 630 around there, so can't go wrong with that. So right now, my man's trying to pull up. He's trying to buy both size 11s, the 11, size 11 pack of lot 50 and a lot one. Let's see if we can work something out. The boy that will bring you the kicks, want them. I want them now, bro. Let's see if we can work something out. All right, Army, so I'm with my boy from X-Rated Kicks. Yes, sir. If these joints pass, my boy Jesse, what's good with you, bro? Hey, if these pass, eBay, 
Y'all know I'm sponsored with it, so they gonna do me right. They will pass, they, they will pass. They gone. <laughs> I told you, I woke up feeling good today. Whatever I want, I'm buying it. All right, so again, my man's got my class. That's funny. So right now we're on our way to the eBay authentication booth. My man said they go pass. If they pass, they go. They go. Hey, so he said if they pass, he's gonna buy them. So let's see. I know they'll pass, but uh, we'll just wait through it and uh, see what they say. eBay legit check booth. They basically guarantee these, all all of I'm these. <laughs> um, they they guarantee all of the the checks are legit, and uh, we're gonna check these out. He wants to make sure they're good before he purchases them and displays them on his channel. Yeah. Like. Oh, white pair pass. All right. White pair pass. Lot one, good that to army, go. Remember, when you at these events, make sure y'all go get y'all shoes authenticated. eBay is pretty much at every sneaker con. You guys saw lot 50 pass. Lot 50 so, pass we're, so we're two for two now. We two for two, army. The black pair pass as well. Lot 50 pass. Lot one pass. So now all it is is for us to come up with this deal and come we up with the to number. Go. Yeah, man. All right, Army. So after a lot of debating and a lot of people stopping to take pictures. Yeah, I got to give it Army. to you. Tell them, tell them. We literally try to do a deal. This is my first time ever meeting him, and I didn't know he told me, like, his subscribers, he told me his followers, but people pulled up in the middle of our transaction. At least how many? Bro, like five, six. At least five or six. Bro. And I was like, yo, did you pay him or something? Like, I was like, at this point, I don't even know. I thought I'm like, man, the army is strong. I love the army, but we came up with a deal, army, and these joints are growing home with They're your gone. boy. So, my guy, we finalized the deal we on did. both lots. We did. Size 11. He we had did. to scoop them up. We did. We did, we did get them authenticated. We got to, again. I'm sponsored by eBay, so whenever, whenever, <laughs> Y'all come to SeekerCon, make sure y'all get y'all shoes legit check. You don't want to spend thousands of dollars on shoes when you go home and you don't know if they're good or not. But my man's over here at X-Rated Kicks, they had legit kicks, so we all good with that, bro. Appreciate I appreciate you, you man. Thank you for the deal, bro. Thank you. And, hey, I'll be seeing you guys soon. For sure, bro. So my guy just pulled up on me. He's uh, selling me Oreo fours, nine and a half, three pairs of fog dunks and once uh, 11 and a half simmer, we're gonna do a coin flip on a few of them. It's gonna be like a $20, $30 coin flip for the, for the pairs. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I won a coin flip, but I got pressed to buy the Oreo 4, so I'm, it's not a bad price, I think. I can't check markets, but we'll see. Appreciate you, bro. Feel free to give a shout out to the YouTube. 660 Kicks on Instagram. 660 Kicks. So he came back with University Fours. We're about to do a 350, 360 coin flip. Tails. Dang. <laughs> two, two in a row heads. You lost every one. Two in a row, yes. <laughs> Keep the heat, keep the heat. Keep the heat. Appreciate you, bro. Grabbed a few pairs that we just needed to sell. We're gonna do like a kind of a challenge type thing, just to go up to random people, ask them if they want to. <laughs> well, look at that. Uh, ten and a half. They used? Oh yeah, they're lightly used. Yeah, no problem. So um, we're gonna go up to people, basically see if we can sell them, and yeah, let's see how much each of them that we can sell at. They're the top three is the only one that's DS, so. We'll see. How much? How much? Take them, just take them. Let's go with Size 10 and a half. These are actually, this is lot 18. 18. Euro pair. The Europeans, yeah, yeah, Europeans. This is not that bad. Oh, this actually would look good with like navy or something. Navy, jeans, 12, 12 and a half. How much is this one? Uh, 500. You traded it? You did it. You did it. <laughs> like the Rolex? Wow. Just got this today, you know, officially a watch collection. Chris, now. what do you think? Official. <laughs> yes. How boozy. Oh, so, hey, wait, 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 let me show you, let me show you. It's got paper. Oh, wow, it's paper. Certified. What's up, guys? I just wanted to offer you guys and see if you guys would be interested in any of these. This is 18. Cast. 18. Wait, no, wait, no. We've had that one in the store, bro. That's a Euro pair. Shattered. 
Those are both used. This is brand new. I'm good on those. 13. I told myself I was done buying two. <laughs> Man, I, I just can't bring it all back to Arizona. I gotta yeah, no, no, it makes sense. But no box. But you can, no box. Yeah, yeah see, so you can just like, yeah, literally just throw in the suitcase yeah, and you're good. You have my attention. Aren't you on 8 through 13? Yeah, but 10 has There you go. <laughs> you can fit them all. Yeah, <laughs> How much are you asking for? Used. Uh, I'm asking 550, well, but I know I know there's six. I think they're like 680 ass, but I mean. For 300. <laughs> yeah, like I'd love it for 300 too. Like, like, are you talking about like five? Upper five. Oh, okay, six. yeah, I don't know. I got them good. We're seeing any of these guys coming. This guy fucking. Who's the guy at the end of the video? Who's low ball? <laughs> yeah. Comment hype low balls. <laughs> Yeah, that's that's gonna be the, the thumbnail right there. That's why I just mumbled. Bryson was interested in the Law 18, but I gave him my number, and uh, he said he's gonna hit me up and see if we can work something out. But we're gonna see what souls, how, how bad he's gonna finesse. What's up, bro? How you doing? Same what are those other bro, things? I just want to see what you would offer on any of these if you would take them. Uh, they're no box. I'll do like I'll run payout on them. Okay, that's cool. No box as well, but uh, 800. The lot, uh, 550. It's a, it's a European pair. I don't know, good. Just gonna go up to a few more people and see if we can get these sold. Hey, boss, do you guys buy used or no? It's just brand, brand new. It depends on what it is. Okay, would you get, be interested in any of these? These are used? These are used. What size? 10 and a half. It's a lot, 18. Much. I was asking for 550, but it's a European pair, so that's the reason why I yeah. asked is like almost 700. Everybody has grabbed that pair. <laughs> you guys bought all those today, or? Yeah. I know Gabe has been wanting a, a good amount of them, so I know he's been hitting me up sometimes for that. What would be your lowest on these? Feel free to offer. I'll, I'll be honest, like, I, I'd be like, I'd be in the five for sure. Like, yeah. I could do five. That would probably be my lowest. I'd be straight up. So, I'll do five. Yeah, it's a European pair. It's, it goes for like 700, that's why. Yeah, you know how people are when it comes to foreign suits. No, 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 I get it. Yeah. I appreciate it though. Everybody's gonna wanna look, wanna buy it, but never uh, pull the trigger. This is probably one of my favorite pickups. If you guys don't know what Sicko brand is, it's a brand created by Ian Connor. He's like a, he's a stylist for a different brands. And this is one of his merch that he put out, straight to the dome. Fire. Big shout out to Fritz Kicks for hooking me up with this deal. So this probably concludes the end of the event. Uh, we're just walking around trying to shop for personal stuff, but nothing's really catching my eye. How the event went, it was solid. Sold by like 30, 40 pairs. It wasn't anything crazy. I expected it to be a lot better, but for some reason the turnout wasn't crazy. Drove out here, but yeah, this is probably the end of the video. We're gonna stay until seven because we drove out here, might as well. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys smash that like button, subscribe, and comment down below what you thought of the video. And until next time. Beeping by the gate, I've been beeping by the gate, I've been Damn, all these stars on my head Okay, it's cool, keep these eyes, keep me fresh Chase sent this through with me, something I can hit